So these are the oils that were picked. Liquid Molly Molly Gen, GTX Magnatech, Mobile One Extended Performance, Valvoline Extended Protection, and <clears throat> Castrol Edge 20,000 mile formula. I will be sending them off today to get them tested by Blackstone Labs. All right, so the oils that were chosen the five most last night, overnight, was Valvoline Extended Protection, Liquid Molly Molly Gen, Mobile One Extended Performance, GTX Magnetech, Castrol Edge Extended Performance. Let me tell you, there was just so many people that just could not follow directions on that video at all. It was shocking. I even pinned a post to the top of the comment section that says if you want to add an oil that you haven't seen in this video, please click on the comment section of this post and add it here. And I think a lot of people don't understand that when I preload in the comment section all the different oils and I say go to the oil that you want, pick up the five oils and hit the thumbs up and that will be our voting system. And you go there and you type in in the middle of the video before the video is even done what you want to see and you haven't even seen everything it busts the comment section up it starts spreading everything apart if you wait to the end of the comment section and then go to the comment section and see the comment that's on top with a little thumbtack in the corner you'll see that that's an important comment and it's good that you didn't leave a comment ahead of time because that addresses what the expectation is Oh, I'm going to just go ahead and put my oil right here, like he said. Easy. No problem. And then if I see somebody already put it, then I'm not going to repeat it again because somebody already put it, and we can start voting on that comment. Oh, common sense. Hmm. I guess people didn't get that. And then while they're commenting throughout the entire video, it's moving all of the oils around that I went to the comment section, and I put in there instead of waiting to the end. Because those comments are time stamped. So when you're leaving comments before the end of the video, you're separating all the comments, and then it's hard for people to find where they're supposed to vote because you couldn't wait to the end of the video before you left the comment. Um, and there was a lot of people that said, Oh, you have Royal Purple HPS in the video, but you didn't write it in the comment section. No, I did. It's there. You just have to scroll around and look for it because everybody else is commenting before the end of the video. It's moving all the comments around and shoving it further down. Or Okay. We got to do better next time. Look at the pinned yeah. comment. The pinned comment is the important comment at the top of the comment section. Before you even leave a comment, from now on, you need to go look at that comment. First, because it addresses things that may answer your question and then... You don't have to leave a comment if it's being addressed. <sighs> anyway. Blackstone kit. Big box of testing kits. Move some of these oils away from me. I've got napkin right here in the bottom all the information we need comes with a little piece of pig mat in case the oil starts to come out comes with information personal to the test and it comes with a little test container Test container mobile one mobile one
mobile one. Molly Jen. It's got a little bit different smell to it. It's green. Green oil. Magnetech. Magnetech. Valvoline. Extended protection. Valvoline extended protection.
more. edge standard performance Now, I've got everything in the containers. I'm going to go ahead and label them, package them up, and get them shipped off. That's the choices for the oils being tested. I appreciate y'all. Have a great day. Be blessed.